Okay, right now before I show you what I've done, I gotta plant some seeds first in this area. Also, there was some weird stuff on top of my soil. Not sure what that was about. But yeah, it was kind of gross. And there's the other jicama. Very happy about that. Problem is that I'm going to have to get it to go up there. Get it to climb, I guess. I guess it can climb on the... Oh, now is there multiple of them? There possibly is. They got... There's multiple of them, I believe. I just need one. Wait. This one looks best. This one looks better. This one looks... Only need one. Only need one. This is from the fireworks, and that can't be in there. Have more, more okra seed left. I guess I'll just plant as a volunteer. Like I was saying, there's some weird stuff on my soil. It's like an oatmeal type of sorts. I think you see in my old videos. Looks like a fungus. I got rid of it. I knew what it was. I dumped it over the fence. Sorry for the sound of the squirrel making noise. Luckily he has not been digging in the soil. He's been digging outside the fence. Let me show you what's up. As you can see, I bought some ladybugs from Armstrong. 1099. It's worth it to get rid of these pests. I believe they're the black aphids. They need to really get over there. I should probably clean up these garlics. <laughs> yeah, some on the papaya. Oh good, some, there's a pest on there actually. There's some pest on there probably. There was one, actually a worm in the garlic as well. I sprayed it, a little green worm. You know, you would find those somewhere. And don't know if that's good or bad. I have no idea. Hopefully, hopefully it's good. Haven't seen any there yet. Been seeing this hovering fly. I guess I'll be getting another corn. All right, let's see if it'll do good. Let's probably get, get rid of the leaves, I guess. Yes, the snail, I believe, eats stuff off the soil, like plant matter. What is that? Weird. Whatever. So, I, when it says I'm thinking it eats stuff off the soil, I'm curious to see what it would do. I'm interested. I got rid of my basket of fire pepper. I liked it a lot. I thought maybe there was a problem with that. I never experienced that before. The peppers struggling, the plant looking a bit messed up. Not like a disease, but I'm not sure, but I'll probably get another one anyway. I have seeds for it, so I can probably grow another one. But I'm thinking of putting a new pepper in there. Like a Thai pepper, I'm hoping. When that happens, of course. I should probably move the leaves so it doesn't... So it doesn't get anything from that. The buckwheat. <laughs> oh, good. This is me just showing you my pink plants right now. For right now... Ah, he'll grab onto it. <laughs> hmm. Not sure to do this right now. 
or at the end of here I'll make an update of what happens with this. I hope this one does well. Alright, I'll make an update. Um someday in the future of what happens with the labels and such. Thank you for watching. Sorry I had to cut. I kind of wanted to fix the cucumber. Now it's up. There's cukes on there. That's good. As opposed to what people say. People say chocos for the child taste squash. Ah, something on my back. Huh. There you go. Huh. You know what could have been a ladybug? They're still around. There was some on the fender last night when I cut. Don't see it now, actually. And this thing's trying to bolt, I guess. Even though I didn't get a big bulb like I thought I would get. I don't quite understand it. Oh well, it's the first time doing it. I'm gonna have to get this. I'm gonna have to have him. I guess, not have him, I guess I'm gonna have to put that up. Or have him climb a little bit. I like those flax. Very good. Oh, I gotta be careful. It's good to help in the artichoke. This is its first year in the dirt. It's good. Should add some dirt to the bottom of there, but that's really good. How did that's grown well? Hope they get to the okra. Seems to be something in here. That's skeleton it. Only two, three, four, five. Okay, five. That's as many as I wanted. Five of the. Good. Okay, that's good. I'm gonna help. It's good to see them in the corn. It's really good. The squash as well. No squashes on them yet, but. There are some flowers, that's really good. Alright, I'm gonna end it here. Thank you for watching. Hopefully, you get to see. Anyways, thank you for joining me for this gardening vlog on me buying the late bugs and letting them go in the garden to deal with the black aphids, whatever those bugs may be on the garlic, and so on and so forth. May you subscribe, like, and comment. Thank you for watching.